Hey there, YouTube land. Today, I'm here to talk about this Rough Rider. It's a Whittler. It's one of their older models. As anyone familiar with Rough Rider can tell, they're using the eye, the old uh, box style. <coughs> what are those called? Anvil. I don't see a number on it, though. keep looking maybe they'll nope well it's the Whittler that has the clip and that's why I carry it I like this clip a lot this dog leg is really comfortable in the hand um, this frame reminds me a lot and might even proportionally be the same as the 38 GEC frame I don't know if they're I know a lot of people like using their uh, proprietary number system for their patterns. Um, but I do think some of those people forget that those pattern numbers are not actually universal. It's just funny. But yeah, this uh, the reason I'm talking about this is because... Uh, and I like how these are mismatched, by the way. Um, this popped off the other day. Okay, and I found out um, by an, an inspection that... See this guy right there? That is uh, glue. But that's where a pen, this pen, is supposed to go through there. And you can see there, it kind of looks like maybe this side actually does. But these are either intentionally faux, and but even though they line up like they should be, or it's some kind of factory. You can see there that there's nothing there. Probably some kind of factory defect, okay? Um, I ended up, so this pops off, right? And this this was still, uh, this was the only thing holding it on besides glue. And so I took it off, sanded it, and then used some of this stuff. And this is the best stuff. This is seriously like, I mean, I would trust this to reattach the soles of my shoes, my boots. No joke, it's that good. And uh, it's made to, to stick and last, and it does. And I can totally 100% recommend this stuff. It's the best. And then I used, I soaked it in some mineral oil, some ultrasonic action. Let it, let the oil get down into all the spots. Um, and yeah, glued this back on and it's not going anywhere, especially because this is like an actual anchor point. Um, and you can see right there a little bit. I, I shaved it down where the glue as it, as I push this down and, you know, use a rubber band to keep it on for a couple of nights. The glue, when it dried, expanded into that. And, uh, but yeah, it all worked out. This is a split back Whittler. I know it's from Rough Rider, right? But that means it's got, you're gonna find stuff like, oh, look at this gap that runs a quarter of this back. Look at this gap. I mean, this one's not so bad. Although this is, a, in my mind, if this were a gap for GEC, Probably, honestly, I don't really send knives back unless there's something actually wrong, usually with the locking mechanism. This is a slip joint. I mean, even if this were a GEC, I don't know if I would send this back. So since it wasn't a GEC, and this was, I think, around $25 ship, probably less, but um, since it's not, this is definitely acceptable. Because if this were $100, I would be like, uh, I don't know. You know, I, I might add, I, no, I wouldn't, I would just keep it and not worry about it. But yeah, this is the Rough Rider Whittler with a clip. Some of them come with spears. Um, there's one in yellow, Delrin, I know for sure, that comes with a, uh, it's a seahorse Whittler. I don't know what kind of Whittler this would be. I, I honestly am not so fond of, like, the different, like, Knittlers or like the different weird like they're called portmanteaus when you when you franken words together um so i would just you know this is the whittler with the 
California clip. Very nice, very well done. Tasteful swedge up here. Um, this is Rough Rider back in the day, punching way above their weight class. Plenty of snap. The only one that is not so snappy is this one. But yeah, just I wanted to show this because uh, I know some, like I didn't, obviously this recovery, if you want to call it that, really wasn't like about changing the, there's a little bit of glue, changing out anything, it was just gluing this back on. So it's, that's an easy one, right? But just wanted to show it because I feel like people, um, it's not often that stuff like this happens, but I feel like when it does happen, uh, people kind of don't know what to do, even though there's only like a couple things to do. So I figured I would show that this one came out just fine, right? You can't even tell. I mean, really, you can't. All right, that's it.